Hey guys, Jared here with Five Pack Magic, and yes, we have the brand new Japanese box Battle Regions in front of us right here. A lot of you have followed me along this journey of growing to be a giant YouTube channel, and you might know I have never opened up a Japanese booster box before. Now, um, this is my first one. I saw it advertised. I, I was thinking about the channel and I, I bought it. I bought it as fast and I know nothing about it. I don't know what to expect in it. Um, I do know that Japanese packs have less cards in it than American packs. Let me, let me grab my scissors. Hold on, hold on. One second, as always. All right, let's snip it there. Give it a little open. Um, but I do know I'm a huge fan of the look of Japanese cards. They're absolutely beautiful. Um, I did a little bit of research on this set, but not a lot because I wanted to be surprised. I wanted to let you guys be involved and let me know what's going on. Um, I believe that there is 63 cards in this set. Um, there are some, I, I don't know if they're alternate artworks or if they are character rares. Um, but I do know there's one with Starmie and Misty floating in the water, and that would be uh, my favorite card to get out of all the cards that I've seen. Uh, but anyways, our first ever Japanese booster box, Battle Region. Let's take a look. Wouldn't it be great if I could read all that? Flap number one. Not too sure what the QR code is. 67 plus. I don't know if that's saying there's 67 uh, cards in this set plus uh, mystery cards maybe um, that one goes there so I believe there's tw I believe there's 20 packs in here six cards each so there's 120 cards that we're going to see um, so let's let's do it this way let's just leave it right there and take a look so all the pack art is the same I am really bad with the names of Pokemon, as you all know, so we're not gonna get that crazy into it. I guess that's telling you the odds. That's gotta be 67 cards, um, chances of pulling, hyper rare, secret rare, all that fun stuff. And there is, oh, there's a new Pokemon. It's called a shining, uh, shiny, shining, shiny or shining Pokemon. And you, it's marked with the letter K is what I read about it. Um, so anyways, our first pack of Battle Region, I I am so excited for this. Um, I hope y'all have a lot of fun watching. Please comment, um, you know, before we flip these, I don't even know if there's a card trick. Um, you know, before we flip it over, please subscribe. Please like, and please comment. I comment back on everything, but let's just flip it over, get into the first one, and I, I'm, we're just gonna kind of go through and enjoy the artwork on this. So I'll go a little slow. Um, I know some of these names on here. Uh, the cut looks great on these. I bet you that's like Pot of Honey or something like that. Um, there is our first holographic card. So that is really cool. And behind that is a beautiful Scyther. Look at that. Um, I think this is also something new that I heard about. You should be able to see these Pokeballs like crazy on here. Um, I don't know how rare of cards those both are. I mean, they look right to me. They look rare to me. Um, so I'll just put them gently over there and we'll dive in. I'm so sorry. I wish I knew so much more about these sets, but like I said, this is my first Japanese set ever. Um, it does look like there's no card trick. Um, and the only thing I can say is, you know, this is going to be a kind of a sampling of what we might see in the next American set. Uh, so the next American set will be in May. I believe it's May 20th. And it should be a combination of a couple Japanese sets that we're getting to see right now. And that is an awesome Bioplume Rare. And behind that is a another shiny card so it might be pretty common from what i'm seeing to get uh, a card is is that like the reverse rare and then this is the rare so maybe there is a card trick so i'm going to give that a try on this next pack i'm sure a lot of you japanese pack experts are like what is this guy doing he's doing it all wrong yeah i probably am <laughs> be nice i'm brand new at this okay 
So I believe we'll do something like that. Correct me if I'm wrong. So there is Scyther not in its reverse hollow form. It looked awesome in its reverse hollow form. Um, but man, we got a lot of packs to go. Hopefully we see some super cool, amazing stuff. So this is, there we go. So that is uh, a character rare. I don't know how rare any of these cards are. I love it. It's beautiful. Um, that is awesome. And behind that, we get, ah, I don't even know who that one is, but I like this. I'm going to sleeve this one up. That is beautiful. So um, I guess like with Brilliant Stars right now, you know, the character rare spot would be inside of the, um, how are we gonna do things here? Let's do this. Inside the reverse spot. Man, we got so many packs to go. Am I going slow? I feel like I'm going slow. I'm so sorry. I'm enjoying this. Um, enjoy it with me. Uh, there's gonna be a lot of comments going on, I'm sure. And you know, we'll, we'll have a lot of conversations going back and forth on this opening. Um, you know, I thought about a lot of people asked me to do this live, but I love doing lives. I love interacting with people, but I feel so bad when people can't be at the lives. Oh, there's another one. I, that is awesome. Um, I did see a picture of that online and I really, really like that card. Let's see what's going on behind it. So this is our first V card. Um, God, this is really cool. So much to open in here. I'm gonna sleeve these guys up. Uh, this Hoot Hoot character rare, I believe it's Hoot Hoot. And this uh, begins with a V. I'm drawing a blank, but there is our first V card. Uh, we got a lot of cool cards. I don't even have a way to stack them all up because I can't cover up Alt Art Charizard. Um, I can't cover up Mew. Uh, but if you are interested in watching those videos, I I'm going to take them down. Um, if you are interested in watching those videos, they're all on the channel. You know they are. Go check them out. It was a fun one. That Charizard, the alternate artwork, that was like one of my most embarrassing moments on camera. I, I, I geeked out pretty bad over that one. Um, so we will. We will. Position. Um, I know a lot of y'all love my little card stands here, custom 3D printed card stands for my friends MJR Fantasy. They have a YouTube channel. They are out of Switzerland and it says five pack magic on it. Love it. Okay, back to the packs. I know I'm all over the place. I'm over the place. This is going to be a long video, but I really hope you enjoy it. I'm enjoying it. All right, so there we are. So yeah, that's the reverse spot. I like the way that's going. And the rare is a holographic, beautiful, uh, is it right? Uh, roar, Pyroar, Pyroar, I believe it is. Um, not even keeping track of how many packs we're going, but I'll let you know when we start to get low inside that box. You might be able to see a small hair on camera. No, not really. We'll do the little card trick. I know, I'm sure there's Japanese people or Japanese pack people that are just like, oh, he's butchering this, the way he handles those cards. But these are just so cool. The reverse spot, beautiful. I love the Pokeballs. That's going to be the big hit right there. People are going to be loving seeing that. That is a awesome card. Is that like a, a specific region scissor i believe maybe i know scissor is usually red it evolved from C uh, scyther don't know don't know i swear i know pokemon but i'm a gen 1 pokemon guy wizards of the coast you show me anything wizards of the coast and i can tell you all day long i might even be able to tell you what number they are in the set and i've been collecting pokemon since i was a kid me and my cousin thomas um man we started off with base set we did not, oh, that was cool. I saw a lot going on. Uh, we did not get into first generation best base set or Shadowless. Uh, we started with the Unlimited and a V-Star hit. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So V-Star continues into this set. Sleeve this guy up. Um, I am not 100% sure the big V-Star Pokemon. Why am I being picky about which one? Uh, 
we're too far. We're too far to go back. I think I got all my big hits up there so far as they come along. Um, but anyways, uh, the big, B, I think it's a, a Typhlosion, a Ty, Typhlosion, might be saying it correctly. Um, that is one Pokemon that I'd really love to see in here. Um, I'm not really, you know, I didn't start off with Pokemon in that region. And so, you know, they don't hit me as big as Bulbasaur, Squirtle, and Charmander. You know, I just don't do it to copy people. But yeah, that's when I started with my Pokemon journey. So they're my favorite. Venusaur is my favorite Pokemon. Uh, can't help but love Charizard. Such a powerful Pokemon. The reverse... And the rare of this pack is the deer. Stant Stantler? We could play that game this whole thing. So there's no energy cards in this. I'm just realizing that there. Um, so yes, you get one card less, but there are no energy cards. Um, we still have absolute tons of packs to go. I know that this might not have a lot of craziness going on i'm going super slow but hey i am enjoying this and i really appreciate y'all hanging out with me and enjoying this too and oh that is a shiny so we got our first shiny that's what a shiny looks like and i'm gonna go a little bit faster because i know i don't want this to drag out too long i don't want you to get bored and sick of me uh, but that is what a shiny looks like you can see uh this like grid square pattern just all over the place um let's i really like the hoop hoop for some reason so our first shiny now i think statistically you get one shiny per box um i don't know if that's a rule or if it's just statistically so that might be the only shiny we see today um i believe there are rainbows in this set um there are some gold cards yep there are uh, so we will see how all that works out for us. So there's another V for us. Um, so we got the V star and the V of this Pokemon. Let me sleeve this up. So yeah, Battle Regions, my first Japanese set. We'll put that down right there. We're not going to cover up the shiny because that is just cool card. So I wonder if we're going to see shinies come over into American. Uh, we did have baby shiny i think those are shining because that's what we had we had baby shinies from shining fates hidden fates you know those were good fun and so now the shining pokemon yeah it's shining pokemon i'm starting to remember now uh i wonder if we'll see that in the next set awesome card these reverses are great and oh i got it i got it i got the card i wanted that is un believable i told you guys starmy and misty floating in the water yeah wizards of the coast all day long awesome 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 i'm good that is unbelievable i am so happy that's the card i wanted to see um i don't even know what else to expect out of this set but hey mission accomplished in my opinion now we can go a little bit faster, right? All right, trainer card reverse and cool looking card, um, like a little unicorn. I don't know why I'm putting some cards there and some cards over here. But yeah, this is definitely a region of Pokemon that I'm not used to. Um, I don't know the name of the region. Go ahead and tell me down in the comments. I'm expecting a lot of comments in this video. Uh, a lot of people that are fans of this region uh, fans of Japanese card, uh, a lot of new people to the channel. Nice to meet you. I am so glad you're here. There we go. That is an awesome V card. Uh, I told you I was excited to see this guy. I believe Typhlosion is that? I feel like I'm saying that wrong. I hate that. Let's, okay, let's cover up a shot. No, let's put it down here. Let's, I'm all over the place. Okay, let's see what we got going on. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs left. Um, so there was 20 packs inside there, and I got Starmie just like I wanted. So happy, so lucky. Let's see, what else do we have going on? So this is Battle Region. It does not mean, there we go, Jinx, that's a cool card. Um, Absol. It does not mean that Battle Region is going to be the name of the next set. Some of you probably already know that. Um, oh, they actually already have the name for the next set. What? 
I am forgetting. Yeah, there's pictures of it online, everything. I believe it's May 20th that we're going to see it. Um, I'm excited that it's a little bit further out because Brilliant Stars is a great set in my opinion. Awesome artwork, those are always fun. Um, Brilliant Stars is a great set, so you know I wanna enjoy that a little bit longer. Um, we have some monster pulls that we've had and monster pulls to go. I will not speak any more on that in case, depending on when this video is released compared to the other videos I'm recording today. All right, that's a great looking card. And a, yes, that is the V-Star I wanted to see. Awesome, awesome. Man, this box is stacked in my opinion. You let me know. You let me know if I'm wrong. Um, you know, I'm not too crazy about the Shining one. Um, but maybe it's a good one, but the V-Star Typhlosion and Misty with Starmie. I, I think those are like the main cards I wanted out of the whole thing. When I, when I looked online and I saw the card set list, those were the ones that popped out to me immediately. Ah, oh, there we go. Another character rare. Add that to the collection. These boxes are pretty stacked. This is pretty exciting to open. Um, the, the variety of cards that we're getting in here. Um, you know, I got this off of eBay. I paid $90. I don't know if that was a good price or bad price. I saw some for cheaper, uh, but they were to be shipped from Japan. So I bought this from a US seller that got it out to me in like five days. Um, so I was very happy with that turnaround time and that experience. but. Yep, I paid $90 for the box. Don't know if it was good value or bad value. You know, regardless of the cards we get inside, uh, we got two packs left to go. So great experience. Um, do I think I would buy another Battle Regions booster box? I do not. Do I think I will get the next one? I actually think I do. Um, this has been quite enjoyable. It's definitely another experience. Uh, the cards are beautiful. The reverse hollows and hollows just have a look on them that you don't see out of the American sets that I really do enjoy. Uh, you know, with the silver borders all around, there's just some extra efforts done to the cards that I think are way better, in my opinion. Last pack, guys. Thank you so much for, if you made it to the end of the video, I tried to hurry up as time was going on. I don't even know how long this video is. Um, I really appreciate it. Please subscribe, please like, please comment, you know, all that normal stuff, but it really does help us. It really does help us. I really do appreciate it. On the road to 1,000 subscribers, trying to be the biggest Pokemon YouTube channel out there. I support positivity with everybody. The last rare, and then we'll take a quick look at our monster hits over there, is going to be V. Awesome. Garchomp V, another great hit. So, in this box, we got this starmy character rare don't know where it falls in the sense of rarity but it is the card i wanted um we did get a couple other character rares the hoot hoot um i apologize i don't know that name um a chandelier chandelier i'm probably saying it wrong um so in the grand scheme of things we got four character rares we got one, two, three, four Vs. And we got one Shining, which is a beautiful card. And we got two V-Stars. No rainbows, no golds. That's my pull rates. That is my first Japanese booster box. I absolutely love it. Thank you all so much, and I'll see you guys next time.